Hi guys, uh, this is Jonathan Lambert with the Mathematics Development and Support Service at National College of Ireland. And this is another video in our series of videos dealing with number theory and more importantly in relation to the divisibility of the integers, okay? Or divisibility in the integers, okay? And this video is going to try to attempt to show that the product of an even integer with an odd integer is in fact an even integer, okay? So let's try this. So here's the proof. So here's our proof, okay? Now, to be able to show that the product of an even integer with an odd integer is in fact even, I need to have an even integer and an odd integer to start with. Okay, so let's say let let a be an even integer, okay, okay. and let b be an odd integer. Okay, so there we go. Now we have an even integer and we also have an odd integer, a and b. Okay. So what does that tell us from the division algorithm? Yeah. Okay. So therefore, from the division algorithm, what we know is that a is even, so a must be equal to two times some other number. Okay, where m is an integer. Okay. Uh, what about b? Well, b is odd, so therefore b. Okay. So therefore b must be equal to two times some number plus one. It must be an even number plus one. Okay. Because it is an odd integer. Okay. Where where n is an element of z. Okay. And we'd like to show that the product of an even and an odd integer is in fact even. So let's actually try that. So clearly, okay, clearly what we have is a times b is equal to, well, a is 2m, so it's 2m times b, which is 2n plus 1, because that's our definition of our even integer a and our definition of our odd integer b. What does this give us when we multiply out the brackets? This gives us, well, this gives us 2m okay, times 2n gives us 4mn. Okay, plus 2m times 1 gives us 2m. Okay? Now, we can take out as a common factor across here. Okay, well, actually, there's, uh, there is a, there's, there's a larger, larger common factor, yeah, but actually, let's just take out 2 as a common factor. So this becomes 2 times 2mn plus m. So there's a 2 here common, yeah, and there's a 2 across here. 2 divides into 4, and 2 divides into 2m, yeah? Well, 2 divides into 4m, n, and 2 divides into 2m, yeah? Uh, and don't forget where m and n are elements of the integers, okay? Now, what does this number here look like? Well, this number here is an integer, because the product of two integers is an integer, 2 times it is an integer, and when we add an integer onto an integer, we get an integer. So 2mn is an integer. And let, let's let 2mn plus m equal p, which is clearly an integer, okay? So what we now have is that ab, which is equal to this, must be equal to 2 times some other integer p, where p is an integer, okay? Now, what does an even integer look like? An even integer looks like 2 times some number plus 0 remainder, okay? So actually what we've shown here is that the product of a and b, okay, where a is an even integer and b is an odd integer, that the product, okay, simplifies down to be an even integer, okay? So what this actually shows us is, so therefore, so clearly, okay, we have 2 divides, well, 2 divides 2p, so it clearly divides a, b, and therefore we have a, b, okay, is an even, is an even integer okay and that's our another one of our small little proofs and you see these are really I, I like these little proofs here they're great little proofs to build up confidence yeah in relation to working with the properties uh, of the integers okay we can move on and we do even more complicated things but actually, actually at this stage we're just we're just concentrating on these short little succinct proofs okay so what we've we shown in this video another video in our series of videos on number theory is that we've shown that the product of an even integer with an odd integer is in fact an even integer. Okay, uh, So once again guys, uh, my name is Jonathan Lambert with the Mathematics Development and Support Service at the National College of Ireland uh, and I hope that this video uh, was in some way intuitive and more importantly I hope that was helpful and thank you for watching.